use the steamer trunk tag. Thing? You weren't about to grab that seed. <laughs> grab that what? Oh my god, I didn't even see that. Let me grab that. No, wait! Thanks for the tip. you could come. I love a good wedding, don't you? Now then, to the champagne tower, my good man! Don't get so close. Wait, no, I want that. Wait a minute. I don't know about this place. Causing this bad mood. Wow, remind me not to invite you to my wedding. Suitcase tag. That's what I need here. Ugh. 
Given Bob two of those seeds. They're harmless. You what? You have no idea the harm you've done, do you? Time to get serious. I'm running out of places to hide this thing. Ooh, this is good. Nobody actually eats wedding cake, right? I like wedding cake. Down here, kid. Get me out of here. I don't want to miss the ceremony. I appreciate you offering to carry me down the aisle. My uh, regular carrier broke a wing when we crashed into the Champagne Tower. I'm fine, though. Didn't feel a thing. Takes a lot to crack you this know what? old noggin. I don't think... Uh, yeah, that's good. I'm feeling a little off. And I don't want to ruin the ceremony. <laughs> in my heart, I thought they were weeds, and I tried to pull them out. But this mighty oak has given me shade, shelter, and something to lean on when I needed it. Just when I thought I was turning to seed, you made me bloom again. I do. Good to see you again, Helmet. I'll make sure this gets back to Bob. did it. Why so nervous? I'm just... I'm starting to remember why I got rid of those seeds. I warned you and I warned you, but did you listen? No! But don't worry, I'm here to protect you. Again. Hey, what are you doing to him? Leave him alone! I'm protecting him! 
him. <gasps> Protecting him? For what? You're about to find out. Seeds were bad news. Oh, now you've gone and put him into a bad mood again. That thing's tough. You make it so. <laughs> Everything is so. <laughs> hey, knock that off. If you really care about him, you'll stop doing that. Don't think I'm hurting at all. You think you're his friend? But I'm his only friend. You make it so hard for me to do my job. Everything was so nice here before you. Hey, knock that off. Ow. <laughs> Almost help. Let's see if we can get to the heart of this bad mood. But I'm his only friend. Whoa! You make it so hard for me to do my job. I don't think gardening is supposed to hurt this much. It doesn't need to hurt at all. Doesn't need to hurt you, I mean. Mom's away! Are you serving up the hot one? That hurts! Hey, look, a mermaid! Mix it up a square, I never. Why do I stock up on side pops? Why don't you get lost, kid? How can you do this to Bob? You love him. Love? <laughs> I don't really love him. If I did, how could I have left him all alone? Helmet? Helmet? Would never say that. Uh. 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 Hey, it's not safe here. Hey, I'll keep you safe. Uh. You won't feel this at all. Uh. Ha <laughs> 
put. <laughs> Tell me if this one's too hot. Oh, could you? You didn't go back for me, but I'll get back at you. so bad at gardening yourself. Think you can handle them now? Willing to give it a try. How about those? Well, I'll just take them one at a time. Yep, all the bottles in the blue bin. Bottle caps, too. Hey, that too. We're recycling plastic now. Can you believe it? So, uh, Agent Sonato, think you could help me with a little... yard work? Wow, what a mess. Yeah. I mean, it's impressive as far as strength and mass, but in terms of aesthetics, it's all over the place. You talking about the vines or that beard? Who's this? Helmet! So this is where you ran off to. Figures. What? It's me, Bobby. It's your Psy King. But... how? Where's your body? I was lost for a long time. Until this one found me. Body's on loan from the mailroom. Hang on. Borrowed lips. Wouldn't be right. Yeah. And he's not as cute as you either. Well, neither are you right now. Come on, let's at least wash that beard. What does that smell? Mushrooms? You know I hate mushrooms. I know. to get into some heavy business. Am I sure I'm ready for this? I'm ready for whatever might happen. Long enough. It still works. Of course it still works. Auto over engineers everything. Crawler, I, I think that's the nicest thing you've ever said about me. Otto, you're looking well fed. Ford, you sound like your old self. Well, some things are clear to me now that weren't before. But come on, there's a lot to be done. Is it really you? Cassie! Compton! And Bob. I'm... I'm... I'm happy to see all of you again. What's Nick from the mailroom doing here? That's actually Helmet Fulbear's brain in Nick's body. <gasps> I do love making a grand entrance. 
Sounds like Full Bear. He's in there, all right. But where have you been? Uh, you don't want to know that. I've missed you so much, Big Bear! I never thought I'd see everybody together again. Well, almost everybody. Hey, I remember this place. We used to sneak in here and fool around on the beanbags, remember? Lucy! Everybody ready? Now, this hunk of junk was made by Otto Mentalis. So, uh, there's no telling what might happen. Oh, what can I say? I was underfunded back then. But if everything goes well, we might be able to have our dear friend Lucretia back in the circle. For good. Now, you ready? Kind of. <laughs> Me too, kid. It is my great pleasure to present to you the I Flying Death Defiant, ironically named Aquato Family Suckers, Augustus, Donatella, Dion, Frazy, Rasputin, Murtala, and little baby Creepy. The most important member of the family, one who's been here the whole time. Nona Aquato, right where she belongs, in the heart of her family. What is this? It's a mental construct I made for Lucy, to convince her that she was your grandmother and that she lived with you. Come on, it's time to get her out of here. did you step in? I don't know. It looks like a puddle of goo. With a mask of me in it. Has anyone seen my brother? He was just standing here a second ago. Ah, uh, here he is. Oh, well, come on, Raz. It's showtime. You better play along with this, Raz. We don't want to upset the construct until we have control of the situation. I'll work on Nona. One. In my sleep? It's a better show if you do it, Rasputin, because the audience isn't sure if you'll make it. Bye! Oh, Colleen, you almost had it! Let's get out of here. Not until the show is over. Three more acts to go. Night throwing, ball balancing, and weightlifting. Can Donatella balance her duties as a mother with the demands of the circus? Join her at the Razorback Arena and witness this incredible balancing act in person. You're doing it, Ro. 
Kill her papa? No one knows! <laughs> the only thing sadder than a child's... Hey, Flea Ford, how goes the show? Well, there's a little hold up with our knife thrown. It's dead right up to the wheel of endangerment. And behold, the daring father daughter team of crazy and Augustus Aquano. One will live, one will die. Maybe. Who knows? Only one way to find out. Round and round the wheel goes. Will Crazy kill her papa? No one knows. I just, I just don't feel good about it. Last time. Careful, Raz. That's okay, son. Keep throwing. favorite son now. Wait, what was that? Wow, Flea Dad tells it like it is. Okay, my turn to throw knives at Dad. Not the most functional family. <laughs> but at least they're all alive. Okay, all the children are safe. <laughs> no, I will show you my little secret. Come with me to the high dive. had a high dive in the Aquato family circus for years. You know, the curse? You know, the more I think about that curse, <laughs> the more I think it's a lot of Gravosknok. Now get up there. Here, and you're coming with me. Nona! 
Oh, no! What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Ford, our circus didn't have a quilting area. I didn't make this. I created that two-bit flea circus to make Lucy forget who she was. But it looks like she escaped. Come on, Crowley, stinky dam is over this way. What? Wow. Guess you learn a thing or two when you live with fleas. <laughs>